Hi, this is JP from Not The Lights of Arkham. Welcome to another Marvel Champions LCG playthrough. We are continuing the Mutant Genesis uh, expansion box playthroughs and we are up to the Master Mold scenario. Uh, in this scenario uh, we have uh, the Magneto ally in play already and we are playing this time with the uh, Shadowcat Kitty Pride which has the pre-built aggression deck and uh, uh, so far uh, these blind playthroughs haven't gone that well. Uh, we were pretty close in defeating the second scenario with Colossus and well we got halfway through in the first scenario with Kitty Pride. Let's see how this scenario goes. So uh, this has maybe the most easy setup uh, so far from these scenarios. So we have the Master Mold Villain in play with 12 health, that's not much, but um, every um, it has toughness al also and stalwart, which I forgot to mark here. So, toughness and stalwart. So, um, force interrupt. So, um, let's see. When Master Mold schemes against you, discard cards from the encounter deck until a central minion is discarded, put that minion into play, engage with you, do not give Master Mold a boost card for this activation. Okay, well, we pretty much don't want to let Master Mold scheme, but uh, uh, we put Magneto in play and uh, each sentinel minion gets guard so when we get sentinels which there are a lot of we can't hit master mold except that kitty pride uh, doesn't mind in uh, in uh, hero mode about that so we can uh, ignore the guard so that that is at least something we could just try to nuke uh, Master Mold with Kitty Pride when when we are able, but we'll see how that goes. Um, I have no idea how this will go, but we'll see soon enough, so let's get started. Okay, and we are ready to begin, so we'll draw our opening hand of six cards. And uh, let's see what we get. So we get the X Mansion, Ready to Rumble, Colossus, Toe to Toe, uh, Face Strike, and Quick Shift. Okay, well, mm, not going to play the X Mansion. Or actually, that would be good with Magneto, because then we can heal Magneto if we go to Alter Ego, but we. Probably don't want to go to Alter Ego that much. Colossus, uh, we probably want to play. Yeah. So, first round, I think we will just play Colossus and go from there. Face Strike would be nice. Actually, let's try to rush it. So, we'll flip to hero mode. I think we could save Colossus for next round. So, we will... Play Strike. I'll use Toto, ready to rumble, and Axe Mansion to play that. And uh, we will... Deal 6 damage to an enemy and actually we'll save save toe to toe actually. Yeah, so we'll play this and use those two and the solid form. So this flips we deal 6 damage. Uh, no, there's tough. Oh, wait a moment. So, uh, Shadow Cut hits tough off, then we'll deal this. So, actually, 
Uh, okay. Um, again, <laughs> a bit difficult because of this. So, back up, back up, back up, back up. So. Let's see. If we hit... I will uh, get rid of, rid of the tough. This flips. And uh, yeah, we'll just use these three to play face strike, deal six damage. This flips again. We'll use that to play toe to toe. So master mode attacks us for two plus zero, so we take two damage. And uh, we keep Colossus in hand, but this flips again. Then Magneto hits us for... Oh yeah, and toe-to-toe -to -toe deals five more damage. So we pretty much nuke the first phase. So Magneto hits for one damage, and we are already in phase two. Stalwart toughness, so we'll return to tough. Post, uh, when Master Mold schemes against you, discard cards from the... Oh, yeah. Uh, I forgot I have to discard cards until I get a uh, Sentinel minion. So... Back up. So, Magneto and... Uh, Face Strike defeated this minion first. And, uh, well, actually, we don't have to, yeah, we'll, we'll stay in this first form, because Kitty can hit past this Sentinel. So, Magneto hit this Sentinel, so after this minion engages you, that's the topmost Sentinel attachment from the discard pile, there are none. So, yeah, Magneto hits this for three damage. But we are still in phase one. Okay, I think that's correct now. So we'll ready up. Uh, we draw back up to one, two, three, four, five. We get toe to toe. Uh, yeah, we don't have the stuff here yet. The intangible interference, quick shift, uh, shadow surprise, and colossus. We'll go to the villain phase, we add one threat to the map scheme, Master Mole attacks, I will take it with Kitty. And uh, we don't take any damage, but this flips. This hits us for three damage, so we'll just take it. We'll get an encounter card, it is unit upgrade attached to a sentinel minion. Otherwise this card gains surge, attached minion gets plus two hit points and gains retaliate one. So that is the first round with after some uh, uh, misplays from me, but I think we're uh, correct now. So that is that round. Let's go to the next round. Let's see. What can we do? Uh, we need to deal one damage. To master mode to advance, and I think I'll do it with. So I'm using the solid to exhaust to get the resource and intangible, and uh, we'll shadow surprise deal here three damage here. So now we advance. So now there's tough here. Then. Uh, uh, 14 health. That's not that bad. But we don't have uh, enough in our resources in our hand to play Colossus yet. So I played an attack, so this flips. Okay. 
I'm paste in uh, I'll use quick shift to draw two cards lock heat and face and confuse so we use these three to play Colossus and Colossus has tough so uh, Magneto and uh, so Colossus hits here so we take one damage on Colossus, so uh, we take the consequential damage on the, the tough, then one damage from Retaliate. And this takes three, and Magneto finishes it off. And uh, that is it. Uh, we'll go to the. We're ready up. We'll go to the villain phase. So, one, two, three, four, five. So we get Team Strike, uh, Shadow Surprise, Attack Training, Attack Training, and Airwalk. Okay. So, we add one threat to the main scheme. Uh, Master Mold attacks. I'll defend. No. Mm. Yeah. Um. I'll defend. So. Uh, three plus. Uh, give the villain a tough stuff. Sorry, it ha already has one. So we don't take any damage. This flips. Encounter card is shields up. Uh, give the each central minion engaged with you a tough status card. Otherwise, this card can search searches. Sentinel mark three toughness, and it has card. I think I put the patrol also in the play last round, but it is what it is. So. Uh, that is everything, so that is that round. Let's go to the next round. I think last round I forgot to heal one damage off of Magneto when Magneto defeated a minion. So I'll do that now. Okay. Um, let's see. How do I get rid of the tough? So, I think I'll use this and one of these to play Shadow Surprise. I hit the top of, of Master Mold and ready my hero. This flips. Then. I'll hit. I'll you play team strike and hit for five damage here. So this flips again, and that is it. Uh, yeah, Magneto hits off the top from here. That is everything we ready up. Uh, I'll get rid of that. We might <laughs> advance, but at least what it is. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, gatekeeper times three. Keep this room and team strike. Well, we'll go to the villain phase. We add one threat to the next scheme. Uh, Master Mola attacks. I will. Hmm. So let's see. Do I want to? I 
I'll defend with Shadow Cat. It is risky. Uh, so we will. Yeah, we can't. Shadow Cat doesn't do anything next round then. Defend. No. We defend with Colossus, unfortunately. Colossus is defeated. Then uh, the Sentinel attacks. I will defend with Kitty or the or Shadow Cat. So I uh, will just take one damage. Uh, encounter card is Master Morph's Children. So uh, each minion engaged with you attacks you. If you are not engaged with a minion, Master Morph attacks you. So unfortunately, we also lose Magneto. So Magneto has victory one. So Magneto just goes away. That's a shame, but it is what it is. So not looking good at the moment. Uh, that is that round. Let's go to the next round. Okay, uh, we have three gatekeepers in hand. They are pretty much useless at the moment. So we'll just play. Hit this room with one of them. And uh, I think that's everything we can do. Is there any point? Let's go to Alter Ego. Well, we need to go there to heal. So we'll flip to Alter Ego. We'll discard our. Uh, let's see. I will heal 2 damage. Then we'll just discard this. That's it. This isn't good, but it is the only thing we can do. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Uh, Face and confused, ready to rumble, shadow and steel, aggressive energy, ready to rumble, and face strike. Okay. Um, we'll go to the villain phase. We add one threat to the main scheme. Master mode schemes for 2 plus 0, so this advances. And we get another sentinel. Another Mark 3 Sentinel with toughness and, uh, and guard, but we can bypass that with Kitty. And the encounter card. Oh, yeah, this uh, scheme's for two. This scheme's for two. Oh, yeah, this advanced. Let's see what happens before all of that. When revealed, shuffle the encounter disc or file into the encounter deck. Each player discards cards from the encounter deck until they discard a Sentinel minion, then puts it into play and gets with them. Quick shuffle, and we'll discard cars. And uh, let's see, we get the uh, Sentinel Mark Six. So it has quick stride, but, but we are in alter ego, so it doesn't have to attack us. Then, uh, okay, well, that settles it. So no, uh, <laughs> there's eight here, so we have one. So all of these scheme for total of six. So we are at seven, <laughs> one away from getting defeated. So yeah, uh, that is that round. Let's go to the next round. Okay, so uh, we need to deal nine damage. So I will uh, I'll go to mass form. So I'll use this. I'll use this to draw one card. That's enough. We'll flip. Uh, we will hit past all of these 
uh, guard minions for two damage. This flips. We'll play phased strike. Oh no, uh, we first play one ready to rumble. Then we will play phase strike. I'll use this and uh, this and this. So we deal seven damage here. So that's enough. And that is it. So I think I played that correctly. But yeah, pretty close game. Uh, we were just able to defeat Master Mold uh, because of Kitty's own ability. So that is quite quite good for this scenario. So um, yeah, first win in the series, but it, uh, a win is a win. Uh, we could have still uh, ready to rumble because this flipped and then hit for two more damage because I, I forgot that uh, aggressive energy deals one extra damage for, for the attack. So yeah, that is the master mode scenario with Kitty Pride. Uh, we managed to score a win for this scenario and I'm pretty happy with that. So hope you guys like this playthrough. Thanks for watching and until next time.